Good evening, everyone. This is Spook, and we are back with Metroid Zero Mission. It has been a little while, and I apologize. I meant to get back to this much sooner. Uh, but, you know, you have a few off days here and there, some long nights, uh, some long days at work, and that kind of throws things off a little bit. So we're going to try this again. Uh, last I played, we had gotten as far as Kraid, and um, I... Did not demonstrate even the tiniest bit of confidence, so uh, I got the crap kicked out of me. I gotta remember these guys explode. Um, they, they, their googly eyes are an attack, and that's something I, I need to remember. Okay, it looks like the game audio is getting up into the into the same place that the. Okay, anyway, I look at the equalizer and the... I, I like to keep my audio, you know, my voice up in the yellow and make sure that the game audio doesn't leave the green part, if that makes any sense at all. Um, I've heard some people say that you should mix it so that your... Uh, your audio is up on... Oops. So your audio is way up in the red, but uh, that just seems like bad mixing, but I don't know. I'm not an expert. So I'm going to take some time to grind um, or farm. And this time, hopefully, I can have enough crap on hand that I can survive the later phases of this fight, which have thus far vexed me. Oops. Of course, when I do dumb things like that, it's just not going to work. There we go. So, unfortunately, the first part of this is me trying to farm uh, talons badly. Okay, I'm not going to try and get the one that's... Oh, come on, I hit down there, dang it. So, yeah, last night I was just a bit under the weather. My stomach was... In... Greetings, uh, Z. How are you doing today? I recognize that somebody had, had written something in chat, but I didn't even take the time to <laughs> read who it was before I said anything. Oops. Okay, sorry, the game audio is a bit much for me right now. Yeah, um, I'm noticing that a lot. Um, I checked out a couple other Game Boy uh, Advance titles, and it... Uh, Boy, it certainly is a, an issue in a lot of them. Um, another thing I notice... Yeah, what you making? Uh, is the aspect ratio is weird. Um, it's not 16-9, like most things expect. And it's not 3-4, like my emulator uh, layout is. So I've got this weird setup for the moment that's basically just improvised on the fly. Oh, nice! Who doesn't love a little chicken soup now and then? Rats. Oh. This is all kinds of badness. Oh, oh, I don't even get a platform now? Oh, he's dead. Hooray! Well, that was much easier. So I've always wondered, what did Samus do before she, uh, <laughs> before her entire life revolved around who was stealing Metroids for various purposes? I mean, they, they say she's a bounty hunter, but I'm like, okay, so what bounties did she hunt? Do they, do they ever get into that, I wonder? Oh wait, this will heal me up if I... Yeah. Yay! Oh, 
Okay, let's go for a run. Ah, yeah, look at that. I knew this was going to be a thing later. I just knew it. Okay. Oh. Wait. Oh, wow. That's, uh, that's pretty quick. Makes sense. Yeah, I've never read any uh, supporting materials, and there's still a few games I haven't played yet. <clears throat> okay, I should be able to get enough of a start running this way. Yeah, there, oh. let's try that again. Because as of yet, I still have to finish Dread uh, and Prime 3. I guess I'm also technically missing other M, which I, I'm never going to own a Wii U, so I'm probably never going to play it. Greetings, Envious Kitten. How are you doing? Oh, hey, thanks for retweeting me uh, earlier with my little thing. I, uh, I made a very stupid mistake this morning, <coughs> and I, I put the words Cash App in a tweet, and uh, I very quickly learned not to do that. <laughs> yeah, that's what everyone says. Um, like, part of me wants to try it for the sake of completeness, but part of me knows I'm just it's just going to be a bunch of disappointment and sadness. <laughs> so I'm not really itching to play it. But I want to cover as much ground as I can. I mean, I like the Prime series. Um, and, oh, oh! This room sucks. You know, I, I, I want to get as many of them done uh, as I can. See, I was really happy with Prime. Uh, I mean, I still am. Come on, nothing? Oh, wait, wait, there's obviously something hidden here. Okay. I mean, I still want to see the... Uh, you know, the FromSoft level designers from Dark Souls 1 do a Metroid game. Because uh, that would be pretty much amazing. Oh, I should not have done that. Oh, well. But yeah, the, the Cash App bots are relentless, and then the... Um, I posted that on emotes for my channel, and I got a whole bunch of designer bo designer bots, for lack of a better way to put it, uh, all over my stuff. It was a little ridiculous. So I, I learned uh, there's another thing not to use or ever say. Ah. No, down. down. Oh, that sucked. Okay, well, let's try that again, and I'm just going to use something harder to hit them. I think I'll just missile them. That just really came out of nowhere. Oh, well, not totally out of nowhere. I see him hovering down there. Oh, wait a minute. All right, let's see what's over here. Because it looks like there's some pickups I can get. I mean, it'll probably just be missiles. Oops. Oh, 
So, I think previously I mentioned that uh, some of the controls in this game caused me some confusion because, you know, I'm used to how he did it in um, Super Metroid. You know, if I want to aim up, I'll hit the R button. And obviously that shoots missiles in this one because the the GBA only had a couple um, a couple buttons to use. It was A, B, and L and R. It's an interesting combo. But he... Uh, So I, I keep hitting the wrong button, and in fact, I was playing Super Metroid earlier today. Oh, I can't seem to... Wait a minute, wait a minute. Wait. Okay, this may be a dumb idea. Okay, and that, those are probably going to be collapsing blocks, if anything. Envious Kitten. <laughs> I, I definitely know the feeling. Um, oh my god, pardon me, my nose is not playing nicely. Okay, I'm getting the idea. Yep, okay, so yeah, if I... I can get that thing to pick me up while I'm in a ball, I just have to time the bombs correctly, and... Um, well, that's where we run into a problem. Well, I hope you get back to the point where you can stream, because I do, uh, I have been enjoying your adventures in XCOM 2. Congrats. Okay, what, just a sec. Why did muting that not work? Okay, am I gonna have to do it with the... Okay, it looks like I... Hello? Test one, two. Okay, something's very wrong here if I can't... Okay, so, uh, my, my board seems to be acting strangely. There we go. Almost. Oh, man. Come on, game. I almost did it. Don't I get credit? Don't I get partial credit? Ha! Can't foil me forever. Okay, sorry, that took way too long. Um, so we still have some unexplored ter territory up, up this shaft and towards the left. And I don't want to miss something important. I mean, I kind of feel like they're going to keep putting critical s or important stuff on the critical line. Or critical path, but... 
Okay, not cool. But I still... I still have a compulsion to explore all the things. Oh, rats. Okay, I guess I just gotta start shooting when it gets me. profoundly silly of me. idea how that's supposed to work. Yeah, it was over here to the left, and I... Oh wait, there's also something over to the right. Let's see if my newfound abilities let me do anything with that. Oh no. Oh, I'm having flashbacks to that Krakmeyer fight. No! This is pretty cursed. Okay, so I'm gonna try running until I get right to the end of the blocks. There we go. Okay. Take that game. Can't fool me forever. I mean, that's exactly how he died in that Metroid Prime, or uh, Metroid, Super Metroid. The thing where I played the game and I died. Uh, that's just like how that went. I, uh, I tried to get that E-Tank and totally screwed it up like multiple times and just died on the spot. Okay, so down to this shaft on the left again. And this time we'll go up instead of down like a, a clueless Yahoo. Oh, 
that's one thing. Not having a real path in mind um, kind of makes me screw around a bit more in something like this. Like when I play Super Metroid, that's sit down for two hours and I'm done. Not a problem. And then I play something where I'm new at it and I'm like, I don't know how to do the thing. Okay, I do not like this critter at all. Oh no. Oh, I do have to kill it though. Oh, I see. They... they that is not clear. The pulsing gray door is not easily visible. Oh, okay, I'm back down here now. Okay, well, it seems like I put a lot of effort into getting a missile pickup, so let's just go ahead. Let's go ahead and uh, go back to Brinstar. See, I'm doing that thing again. Oh, I can't go that way. Oh, wait, yes I can. Hold on, I'm just gonna bomb here. There we go. Okay, let's head back up. And uh, we'll probably have to get Norfair and uh, Ridley's Lair next. What's this, a cutscene? Metroid's given itself over to narratives. I guess this is literally unplayable. Oh, hey, there's Ridley. Very good at staying dead. We gotta go to Norfair, and then, uh... Craig's Lair's probably gonna be down there. Or Ridley's Lair. So it seems like this is gonna be a shorter affair um, than either, even any of the other games. Which I'm totally okay with. Sometimes that just means that you've paced it right. Oop. Although there's still those ruins at the top of the map. Okay, it looks like I'm going to be heading to the right. Hmm. See, there's still this uh, empty space up... This empty gray space that I haven't been to yet. And I kind of want to go check that out, but... Is this something I... I don't know. Let, let's... Let's try. Okay. Um, so we'll head up, take the first right. Oh, look, there's a little detour I want to try. Okay, let's... I don't know if it's a thing I'll be able to get to, but I'm going to try anyway. It's 
So I kind of want to play the original, oh no, the original Metroid on stream for a little bit just so people can get an idea of how, how much more tedious it is by comparison. Because while well, you did have a lot of these long vertical shafts, um, okay, I'm going to head across and set down this time. Uh, but without the map, for one thing, but the, the vertical shafts were much worse than the original. And a lot of it's just because they were using some pretty simple techniques to reuse uh, board layouts. I mean, it was clever stuff, and it's like, well, this is what we have to do. We only have so much space on this uh, ROM from 1986 that we can do it on. Yeah, here we go. Oh, that's all it was? A missile pickup? Well, I'm less than excited about that now. I mean, I could still get it, so I guess that's something, but... See, I remember in the original, uh, to get the ice beam actually required you going under... You know, you'd go through one of these rooms, and it would 